The threat from the governor to cut funding to ports who do business with Cuba came just days before a delegation was scheduled to visit the port of Palm Beach. But port officials continued to meet with the delegation anyway. Members of the delegation spoke to reporters Friday morning and also responded to the governor's threats. Nadie puede hablar de algo que no conoce. Nobody can speak about something that they don't know. Vista hace fe. You know, seeing is believing. Mm -hmm. Lo único que yo invito al gobernador Scott a que visite nuestro país. I would only invite Governor Scott to come and visit our country. The group also talked about the new Trump administration. We cannot foresee what's going to happen with the Trump administration. Pero espero que la sapiencia y el sentido común estén eh, primando en estas relaciones. But I think, um, I hope that good knowledge and common sense would prevail in this uh, relationship. Port officials have agreed not to sign any agreements with Cuba, but admit they're concerned Cuba will do business with other states. We will bypass Port of Palm Beach and then go to Savannah. They can go to Houston because they've already signed memorandums of understanding with them and they can do business with them. The port director is optimistic about the future and says a friendship has now been sealed. And this is the fifth city in a tour of nine, the second city here in Florida, here at Port of Palm Beach. The first was Port Everglades. The next stop, Tampa. At the Port of Palm Beach, Angela Rosier, WPBF 25 News.